Hello students, welcome to our ROSE project. Myself, Mrs. Paul N.R. We have already started the topic Ionic Equilibria. Today is our lecture number 3. First point is the auto-ionization of water. Pure water ionizes to very small extent as follows. Two molecules of liquid water combines to form the H3O plus ions in aqueous solution and OH minus ions in aqueous solution. That means bare H plus is not in existence and that H plus combines with water to form the H3O plus ions. Equilibrium constant K of this reversible reaction is written as K equal to molar concentration of H3O plus ions into molar concentration of OH minus ions divided by the molar concentration of H2O into molar concentration of H2O. That means molar concentration of H2O raised to 2. This is by applying the law of mass action to this equation means the molar concentration of products divided by molar concentration of reactants. As most of water molecules are undissociated, Molar concentration of H2 is taken as constant K dash. This value is taken as constant K dash. Therefore, K into K dash equal to molar concentration of H3O plus into molar concentration of OH minus equal that is Kw equal to K into K dash is called as the K into K dash is called as the Kw here, which is equal to molar concentration of H3 plus into molar concentration of OH minus and Kw is called as ionic product of water. Thus, ionic product of water means it is a product of molar concentration of H3 into molar concentration of OH minus. Then its definition, product of molar concentration of hydronium ions and hydroxyl ions at equilibrium in pure water at a given temperature is called ionic product of water. In pure water, molar concentration of H3 plus ions is equal to molar concentration of OH minus ions and which is equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 molar at 298 Kelvin. Therefore, Kw equal to Multiplication of both these 1 into 10 raise to minus 7 into 1 into 10 raise to minus 7 and which is equal to 1 into 10 raise to minus 14 at 298 Kelvin and this value of Kw changes with the change in temperature. Then next is the pH. pH the scale is given by the scientist Sorensen in 1909. pH is represented as pH equal to minus log to the base 10 of molar concentration of H plus ions or can be written as pH equal to minus log to the base 10 of molar concentration of H3O plus ions and hence pH can be defined as it is a negative log to the base 10 of molar concentration of H3O plus ions. Similarly, POH equal to minus log to the base 10 of molar concentration of hydroxyl ions. Hence, POH can be defined as it is a negative logarithm to the base 10 of molar concentration of hydroxyl ions. Here, pH scale is given. The lower line indicates the molar concentration of hydronium ions and this upper line indicates the pH. When molar concentration of hydronium ion is 1, pH is equal to 0. When it is 10 raised to minus 1, pH becomes the 1. When it is 10 raised to minus 2, pH becomes to 2. Thus, when molar concentration is 10 raised to minus 7, molar concentration of hydronium ion is 10 raised to minus 7, pH is 7. And at that time, pOH of solution is also 7. When molar concentration of hydronium ion is 10 raised to minus 10, pH is 10. Similarly, when it is 10 raised to minus 14, pH is 14. When from 0 to 7, pH is acidic. When pH is 7, solution is neutral. When pH from 7 to 14, then it is a 
basic then relation between ph and poh prove the <coughs> ph plus poh equal to 14 such question may be asked the ionic product of water we know is 1 into 10 raised to minus 14 and it is represented as kw equal to molar concentration of h3o plus ion into molar concentration of oh minus ions and hence from this we can write as molar concentration of h3o plus into molar concentration of oh minus equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 14 taking the log of both sides log of this as well as log of this log of molar concentration of h3o plus ions plus log of molar concentration of oh minus ions equal to log of 1 into 10 raised to minus 14 but log of 1 into 10 raised to minus 14 that means which is minus 14 inverting the signs of both sides invert the signs minus log to the base 10 of h3o plus ion concentration plus minus log to the base 10 of Molar concentration of OH minus ions equal to minus minus 14. And this is this means the pH, therefore, pH plus POH equal to 14 because minus log to the base 10 of molar concentration of OH minus ions means POH and minus log to the base 10 of molar concentration of hydronium ion means the pH. Acidity, basicity and neutrality of aqueous solution. In neutral solution, molar concentration of H3O plus ions is equal to molar concentration of OH minus ions and which is equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 molar. Means pH is also equal to 7 and pOH is also equal to 7. In acidic solution, molar concentration of H3O plus ions is greater than the molar concentration of OH minus ions and molar concentration of H3O plus ions is greater than 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 molar means concentration of OH minus ions is less than 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 and pH is less than 7 and pOH is greater than 7 and in basic solution molar concentration of H3O plus ions is less than molar concentration of OH minus ions and molar concentration of H3O plus ions is less than 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 molar and pH should be greater than 7 and pOH should be less than 7 in basic solution. Then some numericals important for the J need CET pH of 10 raised to minus 7 molar HCl as this is a strong acid it is considered it dissociates completely and hence concentration of hydronium ion is equal to the concentration of acid that is 10 raised to minus 7 molar if we calculate by regular way pH equal to minus log to the base 10 of hydronium ion concentration <coughs> and log of 10 raised to minus 7 is the bar 7 and the calculation will be 7 but it is wrong why because it is acid pH must be less than 7 if pH is 7 that will be neutral but it is not neutral solution it is a acid <coughs> but as it is acid pH must be less than 7 and hence to calculate such a consider the molar concentration of hydronium ions of the water also his total concentration of hydronium ion equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 from acid plus 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 from water because we know in water molar concentration of hydronium ion which is equal to molar concentration of hydroxyl ion which is equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 7 that is constant and his total hydronium ion concentration equal to 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 the 1 plus 1 2 10 raised to minus 7 is common therefore pH equal to minus log to the base 10 of 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 this minus log of 2 is 0 0.3010 plus 10 raised to minus 7 log of 10 raised to minus 7 that means the bar 7 minus minus plus 7 minus 
थ्री जीरो वन जीरो एंड विच बिकम्स द सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स नाइन नाइन देन सिमिलरली पी एच ऑफ टेन रेस टू माइनस एट मोलर एट सेल सोल्यूशन हेयर ऑल्सो इफ यू कैलक्युलेट इन रेग्युलर मैनर पी एच विल कम द एट बट इट इज रॉन्ग हेयर ऑल्सो कंसिडर द वन इन टू टेन रेस टू माइनस सेवन मोलर कॉन्सेंट्रेशन फ्रॉम द वॉटर दिस वन इन टू टेन रेस टू माइनस एट फ्रॉम द एसिड एंड Convert this into in the form of ten raised to minus seven. One into ten raised to minus eight equal to point one into ten raised to minus seven. Therefore, total hydronium ion concentration equal to one into ten raised to minus seven from water and point one into ten raised to minus seven from acid. And one plus this point one becomes the one point one and ten raised to minus seven is common. Therefore. pH equal to minus log of 1.1 into 10 raised to minus 7, and that is equal to minus log of 10 raised to minus 7 is the bar 7 plus log of 1.1 is the 0.04139 minus minus plus 7 minus 0.04139, and we, it becomes the 6.95. The next, calculate the pH of mixture of 75 mL 0.2 molar HCl plus 25 mL 0.2 molar NaOH. First, you have to calculate the number of moles of acids and base. Number of moles of acid equal to concentration into volume in liter. Because we know concentration equal to moles per liter means moles by liter hence number of moles equal to concentration in two volume in liter any is the number of moles of acid equal to its concentration is 0.2 molar and solution in liter is 0.075 and which is equal to 15 into 10 raised to minus 3 similarly number of moles of base nb equal to concentration 0.2 molar and 25 ml means 0.025 liter And which is equal to five into ten raised to minus three. Here, moles of acids are higher than the moles of base, and hence extra moles are calculated as fifteen into ten raised to minus three minus five into ten raised to minus three, and which is the ten into ten raised to minus three. Therefore, as it is monobasic acid, number of moles of acid equal to Number of moles of H three O plus ions. Therefore, molar concentration of H three O plus ions equal to moles upon liter. Moles are equal to ten into ten raised to minus three upon while total volume in liter is point one. Why? Because here total volume is seventy five mL plus twenty five mL means the hundred mL. Hundred mL means the point one liter. And hence molar concentration of H three O plus ions equal to ten into ten raised to minus two. Calculate this. Ten into ten raised to minus three. That means it is the one into ten raised to minus one. And hence pH equal to minus log of one into ten raised to minus one. And that is the one. This will helpful to you in the second MCQ in the textbook of the board. Next is the calculate pH and pOH of 0.01 molar HCl solution. At HCl it is strong acid. It dissociates almost completely and hence first lecture मध्ये आपण बघितलं for strong acid concentration of H plus that means concentration of hydronium ion is equal to the C and hence here it is given as HCl is dissociates like this and concentration of hydronium ion equal to C. And C is equal to zero point zero one molar. That is one into ten raised to minus two molar. And by this formula, pH equal to minus log of H three O plus ion concentration equal to minus log of one into ten raised to minus two. Ten raised to minus two log of ten raised to minus two means the bar two. Bar two into this minus means the two. Thus, the pH becomes equal to two, but we know the pH plus pOH equal to fourteen. Therefore, for pOH equal to fourteen minus pH, that is the twelve. And this is the 
नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल पी एच ऑफ सोल्यूशन इज थ्री पॉइंट ट्वेल्व पी एच इज गिवन एंड कैलक्युलेट द कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ हाइड्रोनियम आयस हाइड्रोनियम च कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन विचार है फॉर्म्यूला पी एच इक्वल टू माइनस लॉग टू दी बेस्ट टेन ऑफ एच थ्री प्लस आय एंड कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन वी हैव टू रिमूव दिस माइनस साइन ऑफ दिस ये माइनस साइन अपने काड़ा है देर फोर इन्वर्टिंग दिस साइन्स लॉग टू दी बेस्ट टेन ऑफ मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ हाइड्रोनियम आय एंड इक्वल टू माइनस पी एच आता हे जर आप एंटीलॉग बगित फ्त मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ एच थ्री ओ प्लस रहना सुधा एंटीलॉग बगाव लगना पाइनस साइन च एंटीलॉग बगता ये नहीं है फ्रैक्शन चाहिए का ही कराएं पॉजिटिव मध्य कन्वर्जन कराए कस जीरो ऐड कराए कस ऐड कराए माइनस वन आ प्लस वन या फॉर्म मध्य जो हा जो होल नंबर है ये माइनस वन ऐड कराए हा जो फ्रैक्शन है ये प्लस वन ऐड कराए इन शॉर्ट इत ब्री मध्य माइनस थ्री मध्य माइनस वन ऐड के लिए माइनस फोर मे बार फोर पॉइंट ट्वेल्व है तो क्या कराए वन मधुन माइनस कराए वन माइनस पॉइंट ट्वेल्व कैसे आल पॉइंट एट एट इत दिल बइनस थ्री माइनस वन का बार फोर प्लस वन पॉइंट ट्वेल्व का प्लस वन माइनस पॉइंट ट्वेल्व का पॉइंट एट एट एंड इट गेट रिप्रेजेंटेड एज बार पॉइंट बार फोर पॉइंट एट एट थोड़क का हा जो होल नंबर है तो मधे माइनस वन मिलवाय बार फोर हा जो फ्रैक्शन है तो वन मधुन का माइनस कराए तो लिखे वन पॉइंट जीरो जीरो माइनस पॉइंट ट्वेल्व कि पॉइंट एट एट मे माइनस थ्री पॉइंट ट्वेल्व च अपन कस कन्वर्जन के बार फोर पॉइंट एट एट आता हे अपन एंटीलॉग बगा दस मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ एच थ्री प्लस आय इक्वल टू एंटीलॉग ऑफ बार फोर पॉइंट एट एट पॉइंट एट एट च एंटीलॉग कि है सेवन फाइव एट सिक्स एंड अपन कस लिखू शको सेवन पॉइंट फाइव एट सिक्स इंटू टेन डेस टू माइनस फोर मोलर एंड लास्ट एक्जाम्पल इज द वीक मोनोबेसिक एसिड इत एसिड कस है वीक है वीक मोनोबेसिक एसिड इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर पर्सेंट डिशोसिटेड इत पर्सेंट डिशोसिशन कर दिल्ली है अल्फा कराए तो ये कराए हंड्रेड न डिवाइड कराए इन जीरो पॉइंट जीरो ट्वेंटी फाइव मोलर मे का कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन दल व्हाट इज दी पी एच ऑफ सोल्यूशन तो पी एच कर हाइड्रोनियम आय एंड कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन पाजे एसिड जेव वीक अपन फर्स्ट लेक्चर मे बगित इन केस ऑफ वीक एसिड मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ एच प्लस आयन्स दैट मीन्स मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ हाइड्रोनियम आयन्स इक्वल टू अल्फा इन टू सी एंड हेर अल्फा इज कैलक्युलेटेड एज अल्फा इक्वल टू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फोर डिवाइडेड बाय हंड्रेड कारण ये का दिल पर्सेंटेज दिल इक्वल टू का मैं फोर इंटू टेन डेज टू माइनस फोर देर फोर मोलर कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन ऑफ हाइड्रोनियम आय इक्वल टू अल्फा इंटू सी अल्फा इज फोर इंटू टेन डेज टू माइनस फोर इंटू सी इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो ट्वेंटी फाइव मल्टीप्लिकेशन ऑफ दिस कम्स दन इंटू टेन डेज टू माइनस फाइव और सीम्पली रिटर्न एज टेन डेज टू माइनस फाइव हेन्स पी एच इक्वल टू माइनस लॉक टू दी बेस्ट टेन ऑफ एच थ्री ओ प्लस आय एन कॉन्सन्ट्रेशन विच इज इक्वल टू माइनस लॉक टू दी बेस्ट टेन ऑफ टेन डेज टू माइनस फाइव एंड इट्स लॉक इज द माइनस फाइव और बार फाइव माइनस माइनस बिकॉज प्लस देर फोर पी एच इक्वल टू प्लस ओके थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स इन नेक्स्ट लेक्चर वी विल सी द नेक्स्ट पॉइंट्स